Following some new details as Indiana lawmakers are busy as bees as the 2024 session is in its final days. Most of the activity actually moved behind closed doors today as House and Senate negotiators try to reconcile the differences on specific bills. Mark Peterson joins us in studio to explain exactly what's going on here. That's some new reporting at four o'clock. Hey, Mark. You know, one bill, both chambers were pretty quick to back. Uh, seeks to give some housing security to bees. The bill would allow homeowners associations to regulate the number and location of beehives on their property uh, within limits. It provides protection to hives that are used for pollination or honey production. That an HOA may prohibit beekeeping within 100 feet of a property only if a person provides documentation from a licensed physician to the HOA verifying that the person or a member of the person's household has a bee allergy. The person with the bee allergy resided at the property before another person began beekeeping within 100 feet of the property. So you can't move in and make someone take the bees out. Seems fair. Some of the bills passed this year are going to have far reaching implications. Uh, others, not so much. They'll probably likely go unnoticed by the masses, at least of the non insect variety. It is do or time, do or die time for all the bills in Indianapolis. We're told the session is on course to end uh, Friday. Well, that's sweet. All right. <laughs> Mark Peterson, we appreciate that reporting. Thank you. <laughs>